Next up we have Hugo Boss Ascent Private Accord. Now you have to find this in a tester bottle to get it under $40. The price just dropped on it, but you can't get these big bottles like this just under $50. This is a sugary sweet. It's got the vanilla, the cacao, and it's got a coffee bean in it as well. It's fruity. It's got a maninka fruit from Africa. That maninka fruit is said to be an aphrodisiac. What does that mean? It means it attracts women and does something to them when you wear it. This has very good projection, very good longevity. It's made by Hugo Boss and it just smells delicious. Expensive smelling, long lasting, cheap fragrances today starts with Versace Dreamer from circa 1996. In this video, I'll show you 10 really cool and expensive smelling fragrances. Maybe you're watching videos and you see all these Pradas and these other niche brands and you look up the price, they're so expensive. Well, this video will help you smell better for less, showing you very affordable fragrances that make it smell very expensive and no one will know. And at the end of the video, we have five really cool affordable expensive smelling bonus section presented in rapid style fire so stay tuned for that as well at the end of the video back to this versace dreamer it has clary sage in it what is clary sage i don't know what clary sage is well clary sage is used to to remove negative energies and it makes you feel good naturally versace uses clary sage in many of their fragrances so when you first spray it you instantly get hit with, wow, that smells good. And you feel this relaxed state. Actually, clary sage is like a green herbaceous note. Back to this fragrance. It also has some rose and tobacco. It lasts for seven hours. Prices are holding 20 to $25 on discount internet searches. Versace Dreamers made for a youthful audience, 25 and up. Today's hidden gem also has rue, rose, oud, and saffron in it. And no, it's not this expensive smelling Afnon, His Highness White. There's no Afnon fragrances in this video. Yet this fragrance that's a hidden gem of the day is from a big, huge, mass appealing house. And all their fragrances, all their titles are usually found at your average department or discount store such as TJ Maxx Marshalls. Can you guess what the fragrance house name is? Comment down below right now. See if you get it right because first I gotta tell you about this next one coming up. Paco Rabanne. Paco Rabanne came out in 1973. Yes, it is a little dated, but it does smell very expensive. It's got the clary sage we just talked about, the clary sage oil that reduces stress, rosewood in it, geranium and lavender, just to name a few. All these ingredients combined together create this Hall of Fame fragrance. This would be great in the springtime or early summertime as well. So will the Versace Dreamer. This is long, eight to 10 hours lasting easy on this, 27. A Little bit more mature audience for this. Perfect for casual days. A signature scent for every day of work. It's perfect for inoffensive. It's got a moderate scent trail and it's a great nostalgia item. Did you guess who made that fragrance I was just talking about yet? The gem of the day. Some of the notes again are oud, rose, and saffron. I'm gonna tell you right now, but first, my name is Christian O, dedicated to you, the subscriber, to help you smell better for less, to connect with other fragrance lovers down in the comments below and ask them anything, they'll be happy to help. And if you wanna just watch all things fragrances related, simply click on playlist, hit subscribe. If any of these fragrances hit your nostalgia, why not share, like, and do all that other great stuff. And now for your fragrance of the day. This expensive smelling long lasting video is presented from good to great with the great titles coming in towards the end as we move up this list. We also have a bonus five section at the end of the video. Please wait and watch that. Now we come to our hidden gem of the day. It's got oud in it, saffron in it, and rose. And not just any kind of rose, it's got black rose. And the title of this came from 2015, Periella Saffron Rose Absolute Oud. Saffron Rose Absolute. Did you know that black rose is only naturally grown in small village in Turkey where the soil and water and pH levels all come together to produce this unique black rose? This is a niche boutique smelling fragrance. Very expensive smelling scent as well. You must go to fragrance discounters immediately if you want to get it before the prices skyrocket. And I'll give you an example. Last year on Amazon, $35. This year, $99. Yet the fragrance discount sites still have it affordable right around $45, $50. And of course you can check on eBay, but those guys get hungry fast when they realize the prices are going up. Or 
If you'd like to support the channel, many of the fragrances on this list are available with this cool scent sprayer for $14.95. It comes out like that. You can take it wherever you go. And to really help support the channel, you can get three of these scent sprayers for $35. If you become a member, help support your channel. Warm, woodsy rose with saffron. In the first few minutes, the oud is quite strong and the florals fade out slowly. The scent is very refreshing and unique, kind of sweet and romantic as well. Afterwards, the simple composition actually goes into a rose leather saffron note with some citruses coming in and it also has labdomum what is labdomum well it's a gummy rose extracted it's a gummy resin extracted from the rock roses of european rock roses this has sillage four to five feet projection is two hours if you're not used to oud if you are not used to oud and floral mixes do not blind buy this if you are an oud lover do blind buy this. You will get plenty of compliments. Highly recommended. Find it before it goes out. And number four on the list is called Ferrari Noble Fig. Fig leaf, pink pepper, mandarin orange, and again with the clary sage that makes you feel good. And it's got sage and iris notes. This is a niche quality fragrance. Smells so good, but can be quite a challenge to find. Sometimes I see the inventories go up and the prices are all over the place, and then they disappear for a few months and then they come back. I don't know why that is, but Ferrari Noble Fig. Next on the list, I would love to tell you to get this CH Carolina Herrera Men. By the way, I just bought this in like a Cracker Jack prize. I got the red ribbon on this one. If well, you don't know what red ribbon means, it's the older formulated version. Some people still have old inventory like that, and that's how you can get. But now I'm not talking about CH Men today. Why did I pull this out? Because this next one kind of smells like it. It's called Bentley Momentum Intense. The intense version from 2017 has notes of amber wood in it, sandalwood, white musk. It's got a seductive scent to it. It just smells good. Ladies love it. It's mesmerizing. It smells like CH Men. Next up is a real great cheapie. It's got like orange and mahogany. It's called Ungara Pur Om Part 3 or just Ungaro 3. Its middle notes consist of jasmine and rose and geranium again and lily of the valley patchouli musk and oak moss the longevity is better than ever and you will smell expensive you can wear this to a black tie event if you want any way you want you can wear this ungaro perome three is right around twenty dollars next up is a great freshy a spring fragrance summer you can wear it right now if you want all year round it's called la coast blanc la coast white to be translated very niche quality, white floral, sporty fragrance. It's got fruity, fresh, compliment getter. Wear it with jeans. You could wear it dressed up. You could wear it every day as a signature scent. It's number seven on the list. As we climb up to the top of the list, don't forget, we have a five-piece bonus section presented in rapid fire style coming right up. Next up, I have the number one, but it's not the number one because of its price. It's just a little bit out of out of affordability, but it's still affordable. It's a great fragrance called Versace Eros. This is a 200 milliliter bottle found at right under $60. You can get the 3.4 ounces, just under $40. It's the most elegant yet wild. It lasts all day and, and night. And if people say you want to go clubbing with it or partying, I say you can wear it after the gym, wear it to work, wear it in any situation you want because it's a great fragrance. La Lique Encre Noir à l'Extreme. This can be worn at work too. You can be casual but be careful because this is a heavy duty fragrance. It's got dark notes, nice cedar woods and vetiver. It's got a smoky, light, but powerful, long-lasting fragrance. It's very unique. And the same person made this, made something called Bentley Intense for Men, which is also another great cheapy, also an expensive smelling fragrance. Bentley Intense for Men has got this boozy, leathery, tobacco vibe going on. The same two perfum perfumer made these too. Next, the number one fragrance. Are you ready? It's got Neroli, it's very aromatic, it's a fougere vibe, mixed with a nice amount of pepper. The longevity of seven hours. It's a two pound bottle and it's called Dunhill Icon. The value versus the juice is impressive. It even has sage and oud in here and iris. Very unique smell, very long lasting, very heavy bottle. Dunhill Icon, your number one. 
right, now here comes your five piece bonus watch. Here's your bonus section of fragrances that smell expensive. And this is my favorite out of the bonus section. It's called Jill Sonder, Zonder for men. Came out many, many years ago, probably right around the year 2000, maybe even earlier than that. But ultimately it just smells very expensive and has decent performance and is available on today's market. The next one's like Jasmine and Apple and Pineapple. It's called Thallium, about 15 bucks. Yves de Sestile makes it. Delicious, fresh and expensive smelling fragrance. You will smell very unique at a very affordable price. Internet discount search, of course. And next one, if you want something for your coffee table, kind of interesting, it's called Zippo Original. You can find these anywhere 15 to $25. It's a nice, it's kind of a basic, so not that expensive smelling, but it's a good cheapy. And the next one that's kind of cool is called Very Sexy For Him Part 2. It's a nice, aquatic, fresh, unique smelling, expensive, kind of-ish type smelling, but it's a cool cheapy, very Sexy for him by Victoria's Secret. The next one is for you gangsters that are like old school. This is very expensive smelling, but it's dated, but it's powerful and masculine. Halston Z14. You get this one. This thing's a beast. What is it? $10, $15 the most for big. This is a 2.5 ounce and they have 4.2 ounces. And the next one's really good. It's called Insurrection Part 2 Wild Edition, which smells like... Havan by Amen Terry Mugler. And this one is just nice. Just smells just like it. Price is very good all across the internet discount search. And finally, you got this one here called Calvin Klein Reveal. Ultra long lasting, very unique, expensive ish smelling. Comment right here. This video right here is just for you. Comment down below if you like this video. The video.